ever heard of Bitcoin, but you don't know what it really is or how to buy it, in the next 60 seconds, I'm going to just break it down to you in order to understand how the Bitcoin network works, how you can buy it and how you can get the max out of it as long as you are going to do your own diligence and learn the psychology of the market. Let's dive into it. Today, we are going to talk about one of the biggest buzzwords in finance, Bitcoin. Whether you are just hearing about it or you are looking in order to buy it, let's break it down step by step. So, what exactly is Bitcoin? In simple terms, Bitcoin is a digital currency. Unlike dollars or euros, it exists only online and is in control by any government or bank. It was created in 2009 by anonymous person which one was discovered yesterday but you have to get into the previous video in order to understand who was the person which one created bitcoin for a group name which one was called satoshi nakamoto think of it like digital gold there is a limited supply of only 21 million bitcoins which one will be mined by 2120 and you can send it to anyone anywhere without a middleman like the bank. Bitcoin operates on something called blockchain technology. Blockchain is a public ledger where Bitcoin transactions are recorded, making it super secure and transparent. When you send Bitcoin to someone, it's verified by a network of computers around the world. Now, how you can buy Bitcoin? First, you need to sign up on a crypto exchange wallet. Popular one includes Coinbase, Binance and Kraken. These are platforms where you can trade regular money like dollars for Bitcoin. Once you are signing up, verify your identity and link your bank account as credit card or direct debit, you are ready to go. You don't have to buy a whole Bitcoin as is it expensive. Right now it's sitting just above $60,000. But what you can do, you can buy some sats. You can purchase a fraction of Bitcoin which one is $10 or less depending on the exchange of course after you are buying bitcoin you have to keep it safe you can either store it on the exchange or you can buy a cold storage which one a wallet is like a secure vault for your cryptocurrency assets and it can be either software based or hardware based software based on your phone and hardware wallet on a physical device as ledger Hold on, hold on, this is no financial advice, you have to do your own diligence and you have to understand when you are exposing yourself to the market, you have to understand that there is a risk reward ratio, but you have to understand the psychology of the markets as well. That's why you have to go into our bio and get your book in order to understand and you can win as well a 15 minutes call with us in order to understand the psychology of the market. Let's go further. If you find this video helpful, just smash up the like button, share this video with other people and comment down below with what you understand and where you are standing at the moment. And do not forget, tag someone which one might need this information as well. See you on the next one. My name is George from Finance Cap Channel. Have a great day.